Do you want your player to be able to do this? First, add some rotation leg to your spring arm. Then, create an actor component for easy reuse and create these variables. Create a function that does a multi-sphere trace along the camera's forward vector to look for potential target pawns. Add those potential target pawns to an array and pass them to another function which uses the dot product of the target's direction and the camera's direction to find the target closest to the center of the screen. Next, set up some events to trigger the functionality, store a reference to the owner's camera component and spring arm component, as well as their character movement component, and on event tick, check if a target exists, set the character's movement mode and spring arm socket offset accordingly, and if there is a target, lock the character's control rotation to face that target. Back in your character's blueprint, add in that actor component and create an input for toggling that targeting. But something doesn't Ouch. look quite right here. In the targeting component, create a function that rotates the owner to face the target and drop that in before you trigger your attack montage on your character if there is currently a target. Ouch. That's better. 